Hey everyone! If you've been looking for the perfect hairstyle that's both effortless and chic, you're in the right place. Whether you're running late for a meeting, heading out for brunch with friends, or just wanting to try something new, today's tutorial is all about the twisted headband braid. It's a simple, elegant hairstyle that works perfectly for short, medium, or long hair, and the best part, it only takes a few minutes to master. Introduction to the hairstyle The Twisted Headband Braid is one of those versatile hairstyles that effortlessly transitions from casual to sophisticated. It's great for taming flyaways, adding texture, and giving your hair that extra bit of style without looking overdone. You don't need to be a pro hairstylist to create this look, trust me, it's easier than it seems. Whether you have short, medium, or long locks, this braid will add a touch of charm to your everyday look. So, let's dive into the steps to create this stunning look. Preparing your hair before we begin the braid, you want to make sure your hair is ready to style. It doesn't matter if your hair is freshly washed or second day, this style works beautifully either way. However, if you're working with clean hair, you may want to add a little texture for better grip. You can use a sea salt spray, texturizing spray, or a lightweight mousse to give your hair a bit of hold and texture. For those of you with short hair, don't worry, the twisted headband braid works just as well. The key is to use a product that will help your hair stay in place, especially if you're dealing with shorter layers or fringes. If your hair is naturally straight, you can also add some loose waves or curls using a curling iron or wand. The waves will add dimension and give the braid more texture, but if you prefer to keep it sleek and straight, that works too. Once you've prepped your hair with product, make sure to detangle it thoroughly with a brush or wide tooth comb. Now that your hair is prepped, let's move on to the fun part, creating the twist. Creating the twist, sectioning your hair will start by parting your hair slightly off-center. You can go for a deep side part for a more dramatic look or keep it centered for something more casual. It's really up to you and what suits your face shape best. Once you've parted your hair, take a small section near the front of your hairline, just above your ear. This section will be the base of your twist. Depending on your hair length and thickness, you can adjust the size of this section, but a 1-2 to two inch wide section is usually ideal. Start twisting now. Let's get into the twist. Divide the section of hair into two equal strands. You're going to start twisting the two strands around each other in an outward motion, away from your face. The key here is to keep the twist tight, but not too tight. You want it secure, but you also want it to look soft and effortless. With each twist, pick up a small section of hair from your hairline and add it into the strand closest to your face. This is what creates that beautiful, headband-like effect as the twist follows the contour of your head. Continue this motion, twisting and adding small sections of hair as you work your way back toward the nape of your neck. Remember to keep your hand movement smooth and consistent. Don't rush the process, take your time to ensure the twist is even and neat. If you have long hair, you'll be working with more length, so take care to keep the sections tidy. For those with shorter hair, you might only need to add a few small sections before you reach the back of your head. Securing the twist once you've twisted the section of hair all the way to the back of your head, it's time to secure it in place. Use a small clear elastic or a bobby pin to hold the end of the twist. For medium to long hair, you can continue the twist a little further down and then pin it securely. If your hair is short, a few bobby pins strategically placed will keep everything neat and in place. Now, if you want to take it up a notch and add a bit more style, you can repeat the process on the other side of your head, creating a second twisted section. This will give you a gorgeous, symmetrical look that frames your face beautifully. Pancaking the twist here is where the magic happens, to make your twisted headband braid look fuller and more voluminous, you'll want to pancake it. Gently pull on the edges of the twist to loosen it slightly. This gives it that soft, romantic feel and adds texture, making the twist appear thicker than it really is. Be careful not to pull too hard, especially if you have fine hair, as you don't want the twist to come undone. 
Just a gentle tug here and there will give you the volume you're looking for. Finishing touches now that your twist is secure and looking gorgeous, it's time to finish off the look. You can leave the rest of your hair down for a more relaxed vibe, or you can gather it into a low ponytail or bun for a more polished finish. If you've curled your hair, let those soft waves flow naturally. To add a bit of sparkle, you can accessorize with a few decorative hairpins or a delicate headband. This will take your look to the next level, making it perfect for a special occasion or a night out. Finally, don't forget to set your style with a light mist of hairspray. This will help keep everything in place, especially if you're going to be out and about all day. Adapting the style for different hair lengths whether you have short, medium, or long hair, this twisted headband braid can be adapted to suit your length perfectly. Here's a quick breakdown for each hair length. Short hair, if your hair is chin length or shorter, focus on creating a tighter twist. You won't need to gather as much hair as you twist, but the key is to keep it close to your scalp for a sleek and defined look. Since you'll have less length to work with, bobby pins will be your best friend to secure the style. Medium hair, for shoulder length hair, you'll have enough length to create a more pronounced twist. You can either leave the rest of your hair down or gather it into a loose, low bun at the nape of your neck for a more sophisticated look. Medium length hair gives you versatility, so feel free to experiment with different finishes. Long hair, if you have long hair, you have the luxury of playing with different versions of this style. After you've created your twist, you can braid the remaining hair or gather it into an elegant low ponytail or a high bun. You can also create a second twist on the other side of your head for added detail. No matter your hair length, the twisted headband braid is a flattering and functional style that works for any occasion. Styling options for different occasions One of the reasons this hairstyle is so beloved is its versatility. It can be styled differently depending on where you're headed or the look you want to achieve. Casual look If you're going for a casual, laid-back look, Leave your hair down after completing the twist. The braid acts as a built-in headband, keeping your hair out of your face while adding that touch of elegance. Work or business, for a more polished, professional style, gather the remaining hair into a low, sleek bun or ponytail. This will keep your hair neat and out of the way while still showcasing the twist. Special occasions, going to a wedding, party, or any formal event, you can dress up the twisted headband braid by adding delicate hairpins or flowers for an extra touch of glamour. You can also create a second twist on the opposite side for a more intricate look. Troubleshooting common problems now, let's address a few common challenges you might face while creating the twisted headband braid, flyaways, if you have flyaways or baby hairs that won't stay in place, a light mist of hairspray or a dab of pomade will do the trick. Smooth them down with your fingers or a toothbrush to keep everything neat. Loose twists. If your twist feels too loose or keeps falling out, try using smaller sections of hair when you twist. This will give you more control and make the twist more secure. Also, make sure you're using enough bobby pins to hold everything in place. Flat twist. If your twist looks too flat or lacks volume, don't forget to pancake it by gently pulling on the edges. This small step can make a big difference in how full and textured your twist looks. Conclusion and there you have it, a simple, elegant twisted headband braid that works for any hair length and any occasion. Whether you're running errands, heading to the office, or attending a special event, this hairstyle is sure to turn heads. With just a few steps and minimal tools, you can create a look that's both effortless and stylish. Give it a try and let me know how it turned out for you. Remember, practice makes perfect, so if it doesn't turn out exactly as you imagined on the first try, don't worry. Keep experimenting and adjusting until you find the version that works best for you.